the mountain which generates wealth, the Iwami Ginzan silver mine and its cultural landscape. This mountain area in the Shimane prefecture of southern Japan is home to remains of the Iwami Ginsan silver mine. The first silver was found here in 1526. This is Rugenji Mabu. Mabu means mine shaft in Japanese. These galleries were dug with hammer and chisel. Mining proceeded at just 30 centimeters a day. 600 galleries were dug inside the mountain. Iwami Ginsan became one of the largest silver mines in the world. This area is under excavation. Tools found during digs show that the copulation method was used to smelt silver ore. It was the most advanced smelting technique of the period. In the process, bellows are used to pump air into a furnace Silver ore mixed with lead is placed inside. The two are melted to make an alloy. The alloy is then heated on a bed of ash, which absorbs the lead and leaves fine silver. The use of the copulation method transformed Iwami Ginzan into a treasure mountain. War followed to gain control of it. The man who finally put an end to the conflict was Motonari Mori. This is one of the many coins produced by the Mori family. This coin was dedicated to the emperor. In the year 1600, the army Mori was allied to lost a forces led by the shogun warlord Iyasu Tokugawa. He put Iwami Ginzan under government control just 10 days after winning the battle. The Tokugawa dynasty supported technology and advanced mining techniques that would help the mine's development. The mine's refined silver was transported to the coast along mountain paths. This bay still retains some of the features of what was a port. Silver was shipped to Nagasaki for export. During the late 17th century, silver output decreased dramatically. The silver rush at Iwami Ginzan came to an abrupt end.